Good morning. It is. What's that? Half past six. Twenty-five to seven. And I'm doing the washing this morning. Okay. Not entirely sure how this angle is, right? Now that's done. Let's see if we can get through this door. Whoa. There we go. Oop. Past the X5. It's the X5. Pop the washing here. Okay. I'm going to brief you guys what's happening today. But first of all, morning flash. Nice and warm in here. Because I am cold this morning. But first, sweet. Let's get everything turned on. Have a brew. I'll see you guys at the desk. So what is happening today? Today we have X5 being complete and we have a valet coming in. So hopefully it's gonna be Scott completing the coating on the X5, I'll be watching over that one. And then Jamie's got this valet when he comes in. Me and Jamie are gonna be working on some chemical stuff that's coming up and I'm gonna hopefully work through all these niggles and get the YouTube up to date a little bit. It's got lots of content on there, it's just not scheduled, tweaked and sorted. So as well as the list of many things to do, that's probably gonna be how today will pan out, but who knows who's gonna come through the door. The time is now. There we go, five past nine. I've just dropped the customer at their place of work, taking advantage of the free pick up and drop off in Elgin. And Jamie's now well underway with the gold ballot. Little Alpha is looking sweet. Hello, guys. It is. It is. It is. Ah. Yes. <laughs> Ten to one. And we have finished the gold ballot on the Alpha. Just gonna do the final inspection and then we go and drop this off to the customer up at the college in Elgin for free as we are fully insured for goods worked upon and to drive your vehicles. So we do a free pickup drop off in Elgin. How nice does this car look? Really like this little Alpha. Gold valet complete. Let's take it up the town. And there's no messing today. Alpha dropped off straight into that's right, a little Nissan Note. I'm very, very excited to machine this little thing. It's got a cracking little flake in it. Some little car. And I've just come in from showing you guys the Note out there and seen Scotty doing the windows and thought, hmm, this is a prime moment for a tip of the week. And details tip of the week when cleaning glass. As you can see, Scott's just wiped it over with what we call the wet cloth. And now he's gonna come with another one, which we call the dry cloth. That's right, two cloths when cleaning glass. And then, it is a bit unfair, I know, but we use the lights uh, and the torches to check for any smudges. So if you're doing your windows, Try and see if you can use anything around you as a light, street light, or a garage lamp you might have, or your mobile phones with LED light, and use it to imitate the sun, and that way you hopefully find those smudges and get rid of them before you're driving and go, ugh, missed a bit. Hope that helps you out, guys. Shishing! The time is, mm, quarter to six, and uh, we're done. Jamie's got this one finished, but due to the dust, We've dried it, so tomorrow we're gonna have to clay it, because if we've done it when it's wet, we've basically been wet sanding the whole thing. That's it for tonight, guys. I will see you all tomorrow. Ciao.